guys welcome back to my channel if you're new my name is Shelby and welcome so today's video is a very exciting and different type of video that we're doing up on my channel usually I stick to like makeup tutorials hauls a little bit of challenges like every so often but today we have a special guest Alexa <laughs> I have seen other people on YouTube use the A word on their channel, but the ones that I've seen, they were ordering makeup, so they were having her order the makeup, and then they were testing out the makeup that she ordered. I'm going to use the makeup that I have, and I'm going to have her choose that way. So pretty much I picked out five of each category of makeup, foundation, primer, concealer, powder, etc., and I'm going to have her pick a random number, one through five, and then we're going to use that product that is like the number. You know what I mean? I did include some of my favorite products and then I included some of the products that I absolutely hate, which I feel like I need to get rid of, but maybe in a decluttering video in the future. But anyways, that's how we're going to do it. See how well Alexa knows me. So of course we're going to start off with a primer. She might repeat herself a little bit. I'm not sure if she really knows how to count one through five, but we'll see. Alexa, pick a number one through five. Here's a number between one and five. It's five. We picked the Dr. Brandt Pores No More Luminizer Primer. This is an alright primer. It just makes me really oily. Like, if I wear this underneath my foundation and I want to wear it throughout the day, I look like a hot mess because your girl has oily skin. Alexa, pick a number one through five. Here's a number between one and five. It's one. She picked the Physician's Formula, the Healthy Foundation. I actually really like this, so... We are going to look very, very luminous and oily today because she picked a luminous primer and a luminous foundation, so... Alexa, pick a number 1 through 5. Here's a number between 1 and 5. It's 3. She picked the Makeup Revolution Conceal and Define Concealer. This is actually a really good concealer in my opinion. Alexa, pick a number 1 through 5. It's 3. Cover FX Perfect Setting Powder, my all-time favorite. Alexa, pick a number one through five. It's two. So she picked the Physician's Formula, the Butter Bronzer. Alexa, pick a number one through five. It's four. She picked the Pretty Vulgar Blush. Alexa, pick a number one through five. It's two. No, girl, you did me wrong. <laughs> the Jeffree Star Cosmetics collab with Manny MUA. This is in the shade Eclipse. Alexa, pick a random number one through five. It's three. She picked the Essence Lash Princess False Lash Effect Mascara. Alexa, pick a number one through five. It's two. AOA Sculpting Brow Pencil. Alexa, pick a random number one through five. It's four. NYX Control Freak, my all-time favorite eyebrow gel. Alexa, pick a number one through five. It's three. She picked the Tardis Lip Paint in the shade Bling, just like a berry color. Alright, so Alexa picked out a full face of products. Now let's put these products on my face. So for primer, she did pick out the Dr. Brandt Pores No More Luminizer Primer. So I'm going to look very shiny and oily. This is a very luminous primer. I do really like this primer if it just didn't have a lot of shimmer in it. I actually got this in a boxy charm, so that's why I have it. Usually I would not go out and buy a luminous primer for myself. To make ourselves even more glowy, we're going to go in with the Physicians Formula, the Healthy Foundation. This is also a super glowy foundation. I did do a full review, wear test, first impression on this foundation. So if you guys are wondering if this is a really good foundation, then I'll just link it. I actually really do like it. Even though I have oily skin and large texture, it's going to be really nice to wear in the summer when I don't want a heavy, cakey looking full coverage foundation. This is definitely like a light to medium. I have to add a lot on my skin. But I noticed that I don't really feel cakey even though I add like a shit ton on my skin. <laughs> Guys, I look like a greasy mess. I've never been so luminous in my life. <laughs> oh my goodness. And for concealer, 
Alexa picked out the Makeup Revolution Conceal and Define, and I have this in the shade C3. And that foundation, I have the shade LC1. Okay. No, 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 no. This concealer blends out beautifully, so quickly, and just so effortlessly. I think that's one thing that I really enjoy about it. So we're using the Cover FX Perfect Setting Powder today. And set this face. Get it a little bit more matte. This powder never makes you look cakey no matter how much you put on your skin. And then for brows, she chose the AOA Sculpting Brow Pencil. And this is in the shade Dark Brown. Not, I don't remember if I like this or not. It is like one of those thicker tips, so I'm not a huge fan of it because I like really skinny, tiny tips so I can get a nice little like wing out here on the end. It's so pigmented, it's like if you mess up once, then you're screwed. Brows are complete. They're really not that bad. I thought they were going to be a lot worse than this. They're just a little dark, but shape really isn't the worst. I've had better brow days, but I mean, we worked with what we had. Let's bronze the skin, add some life back into it. We're going to use the Physician's Formula Butter Bronzer. And then for blush, she picked out the Pretty Vulgar Blush in the shade Hush Blush. Very cute, rosy, mauve. I'm just going to apply this right here. I just drenched myself in Smashbox Primer Water, hoping that kind of just like sets all this powder so this highlighter doesn't go everywhere. In the meantime, I'm going to set my brows with the NYX Control Freak Eyebrow Gel. This is my favorite eyebrow gel of all time. Let's dip in. It just like, it literally just falls. It's, yeah, all over my pants. Like, what the hell? What is this? And then I'm gonna apply it right here while it's still a little wet. So it kind of just like sticks to that area. Yeah, there we go. That's what I want. Huh, maybe I just figured out how to use this highlighter that I've literally had for like a year, I feel like. Maybe that's the trick, to like wet your face and then put it on, because I don't really see any fallout like right down here where I usually do. Now I'm going in with the Essence Lash Princess Mascara. Um, I don't really like this mascara, it's so like, I don't know, it's too much product. I'm going to go apply false lashes really quickly and then we'll be back to put the lippy on, set this face, and then we will be complete. So now let's apply our lippy. And again, this is the Tardis Lip Paint in the shade Bling. It's such a cute berry color. Oh my goodness. I haven't even worn this actually. Like I just got this. This color is so stunning. I'm obsessed. I think it's such a cute staple color. So happy I picked this up. So let's set this face. I'm going to first use the Smashbox Primer Water and then the Ofra Makeup Fixer Mist. <laughs> Alright guys, and this is the completed look that Alexa chose. Honestly, I think Alexa's got some good taste, girl. I think this makeup looks stunning, especially this highlight, now that I know how to apply it. I actually really like this look. Super simple with a bold lip is my favorite type of looks ever. Ever. Alexa, do I look pretty? Yes, but take it from someone with no physical form. Beauty really does come from within. <laughs> Thanks, girl. <laughs> Alexa, does my makeup look pretty? Sorry, I don't know that one. Okay, well, she really has no opinion on my makeup or how I look, so 
whatever. I hope you guys really enjoyed this challenge. I think it was really fun for her to actually pick out the makeup products and me not have any say in it at all and I think it turned out really nice and really pretty. Before you head out don't forget to subscribe and hit that little notification bell next to it to be notified every time I upload. I have some great ideas coming up maybe involving Alexa, maybe not. I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye loves.